everyone, it's Amy. My hair's a mess. We've been running since 8.30 this morning. We left the house. It's 5.30. We're tired. Yeah, so. Um, hashtag the good eyes. And water. Okay. Let's do some Walmart. Got a gallon of milk. Really needed nothing at Walmart. We would basically just stop there to get some. To look at the cleaner. Um, got some spring mix. Got some bananas. Some of the brownies and some of the oatmeal cream pies. Tony got some more of this apple pie ice cream. He really liked it. And I got some more of the chocolate fudge brownie. This is really good. I need some coffee creamer. I haven't seen this before. It could have been there in this like for months and months. I don't know. But it's cinnamon vanilla cream. That. It's actually cold out this evening, and they're saying a winter weather advisor for tomorrow evening, you know, Wednesday. I don't know when you'll see this. But. Oh, I'm actually hoping so. We've had the worst winter, no snow. I'm irritated. <laughs> so we got some Brock's classic jelly beans. find what I wanted at the Dollar Tree. They have two kinds of Hubba Bubba. Well, there's three kinds technically, but at the Dollar Tree they have the ones that have like the twisted ends. And then they have ones that are in little wrappers that you tear. They're super soft. That's the ones I like. So, at Walmart I grabbed some of the Hubba Bubba Max. So, that. And I'll probably regret it because I haven't had aspartame in months so yeah. I'm sure it's gonna make me feel like dookie pick up some fruit punch flavored peeps get some sour watermelon peeps now last year I tried the sour cherry and they were fantastic they were so These were on clearance for a dollar oh seven. It's the um, and we bought some at another Walmart that were dollar forty six. So all WalMarts are different. Okay. Anyway, they're just marshmallow hearts with some crystallized sugar on top of them. Tony got some of these famous famous cookies. And I grabbed the right ones this time. These have chocolate. <laughs> And no nuts. I gotta grab some other bags. Hold on just a second. Oh, grab a little tiny, tiny bag of um, mandarin oranges, clementines. Mandarins, whatever you want to call them. These are called Clementinas. <laughs> it just made me wonder if, um, if Tina over at Philip Fairbairn must discover these Clementinas. <laughs> Give me just a second. Oh. Oh. Right. 
Here's from another store, another thing of the marshmallows. We got some miniature cupcakes. All this stuff was 50 bucks on off. And then got some. This is the weird thing. The marshmallows were cheaper at the second store, but at the first Walmart, these sandwich cookies were cheaper than the second store. So, I don't know. Okay, so that is Walmart. Let's get into some thrifting. Okay, so we went to the Goodwill. Picked up this hat. It looks like it's never been worn. There was every thrift store we went to today. There was no internet connection, or you know, like you know, cell service. So that was really annoying. But anyway, this was only a dollar, so I picked up this Tennessee 1998 National Champions hat. <clears throat> I really like the look of this basket. So, it's a basket. No. It was only two dollars. This would be really nice, actually, sitting on the back of a toilet or something. You can put your toilet paper in there, and it looks all pretty. Um, I picked up. This is like super vintage. I wonder what year this was. doesn't say anywhere but this is winter wonderland stocking and it's only 50 cents so you can make your own little stocking and then I found this is the last thing from no there's also that right there I found this box and I'm with these metal pieces these are metal I thought this is gonna be expensive or you know more than I want to pay for it but it was only a dollar so yeah you know this was coming home with me I don't know if this is something somebody made because it's oh wait well duh I forgot there was a tag on the bottom of it it says compare at $15 but it was $7.99 wherever it was sold and then I picked it up for a dollar that was not bad at all. Second thrift store was Reach. Was Reach, right? Reach store, we didn't buy anything. Um, sometimes book collections are a good seller. So I went ahead and grabbed, they had all three of the 50 shades. So I don't know if it'll be worth anything, but they were 25 cents a piece. So it's like, well, if they're not worth anything, I'll read them and I'll pass them on. Sorry, we sure this <laughs> Um, oh yeah, this last thing from Goodwill. I'm probably going to have to buy another. Wow, this was originally $39.99 from Hobby Lobby. We paid a dollar. Oh. Sorry about that. Alright, anyway, only a dollar. And when it was 40 bucks at Hobby Lobby. I didn't notice that on the back of it. I was like, it's a dollar. Even if I have to buy another kit for it. Because it has a battery in it, but it is not running. And it looks like the arm got bent. But, you know, it's actually just pretty just hang on the wall. Last few things, we're back to reach now. <laughs> Found this super cute little lamp. What does it say on the bottom? It's probably says it made in China. <laughs> made in Hong Kong, actually. Hmm. Stuff hasn't been sent here from Hong Kong in probably a long time. Oh wow. So it's got a map around the can y'all see that? Yeah, that's it. And so it's just a little lamp. It's two dollars. Thought it'd be good in our um, exploration room. 
Tony found another one of these things that went over the electric post back in the day. Somebody turned this into a candle holder. Yeah. So, I don't know if they just didn't know what it was. I don't know how they had it set, set up. I don't either, unless they had it set down in something. Probably. But they're not candle holders, people. <laughs> Some are actually worth something. Like, if you can find the colored glass ones. I found these. I'm going to probably try to resell. These are officially licensed. Brand new NFL. Denver Broncos. Earrings. They were only a dollar. So, that's awesome. Nickel free. And, you know, that last Goodwill we went to, they had an actual Gucci purse back behind the camera. Really? 200 bucks. Wow. The lady said that they had verified it through the serial number. Oh, wow. And we picked up... What are these, like, little valets pick, yeah, or whatever? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Wouldn't it be good to put remotes in? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. It needs to be cleaned up. But only $2, and I was like, that's a steal right there. They had a really nice metal desk, like an old school metal desk. But, and it was only $20, but there's no way we could have got it home. <laughs> I guess last thing is the Dollar Tree. And we didn't find, oh wait, yeah, we, we did find something with that second Goodwill. So we got this um, Allen, or all, all fan, ceiling fan, and light remote control. Ceiling fan and light remote control for all brands of ceiling fans. It was a dollar. So. You had to go out to the vehicle and get changed because I didn't have any money on me. We never carry cash. We have that has to stop. It seriously does because thrift stores, some don't even take debit. Yeah. So yeah, he went out to the car to get. Yeah, I wasn't about to uh, try to use a debit card for a, a buck and like seven cents or whatever it was. Yeah. Local bread. <laughs> I picked up three pairs of the Frap Queen socks. One of them's mine. I'm keeping one of them. So, but yeah, these are just too cute. I'm gonna crystal. If you don't have one of these, one of those is yours. As long as you don't have one, that one's mine. And then, then I got another one. So. I know those are in high demand. Everybody wants them. I was really wanting us. I don't know why. I really wanted some pecans. So I grabbed some pecans to have as a snack. And Tony got some wind up teeth. They've had these in the past, but this time they had pink. So that looks a lot more natural than red. Because if your gums are that red, you got some bad gingivitis. Alright. Yeah, I went to two Dollar Tree. I picked up two of these Toys R Us coloring and activity books. And they come with a 30 sheet of stickers in the front. So. Not those. Pick up a thing of cheddar and bacon potato skins. So the first Dollar Tree, which was this one, we were both starving, but the only thing we came out of there, we were good. <laughs> we didn't end up getting a lot of candy. Um, we got the potato skin snacks and um, cookie butter. I finally made it home with some because I bought some of this before, but somehow we left a bag at the store. <laughs> so we never got it, but they had it in again. So grab that. Got some cleansing wipes. And I got two of these navy baskets. I am loving this navy. This navy is gorgeous. Thank you Dollar Tree for coming out with more, you know, storage containers that aren't like hot pink and neon green. And Look, I love pink. I do. I love pink. But... I don't want it all over my house. <laughs> like, I want something. I won't use this in the kitchen. Um, 
a KitchenAid mixer is cobalt blue. I'm going to take some of those cable things and put this right between where the cable would go, the cable, the cable hangers. Put these on the wall if they'll stay. And then put like dishcloths on them. So we'll see how that works. That's it. Um, we did not have luck with went to four thrift stores today and didn't find anything to resell. So that was a bummer. And oh my nose is itching. I'm sorry, but that's it. That's our haul. We didn't need anything this week. And I'm actually, I'm just sitting here looking at that clock like, wow, I had no idea that was Hobby Lobby $39.99 for a dollar. Yeah. That's awesome. There's not even a Hobby Lobby anywhere around here. The closest one's Asheville. So, that's it. Be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. Hit that bell so you never miss a video. And we'll see you next time. Bye.